So we're now in the pressurization mode where we're pressurizing the house. And uh, what we're really looking for is not so much whether we're pressurizing the house, but is the fan blowing towards us? And for this style of fan, if the fan is blowing towards us, then we must properly reference the fan, which, me which means to measure the pressure across the front of the fan. And to do that, we have to have this clear tube hooked up to the outside. It comes up here and it goes to the reference port on channel B. So here we're measuring the suction pressure from the front of the fan to inside the fan. Because the fan is blowing towards us, we need to have this clear reference tube hooked up. And I just want to show what happens if you don't do that. So now it's hooked up correctly and we're going to be measuring a flow I think of around 300. When we disconnect that, which is the equivalent of not hooking it up correctly, we measure about 600. So let's just try that. We're going to again try to achieve 50 pascals here. We're on the B ring. We're pretty close to 50 pascals. We're measuring 353 CFM. So if we disconnect this tube, you notice the flow immediately jumps to 548, which is an incorrect reading, which is a result of not using this reference tube. So with this reference tube uninstalled, we get a very, very bad error for this particular style of gauge. There's another way that this can be done. With this style of gauge, it has what's called smart referencing and it knows what direction the flow is going on the fan and it makes the mathematical subtraction of that pressure instead of subtracting it pneumatically as we're doing here it subtracts it electronically inside the gauge itself so this kind of gauge you never have to worry about it as long as you put the tubes in the right place it always knows what to do and it does the right thing. There's a third style of fan which is called the self-referenced fan this one is called the Model 3000 SR for self-referenced. Self-referencing has two flow pressure tubes, one uh, which goes to ref B fan, which is how the gauge is marked, and the other is just called B. So all we do is we go yellow to yellow, green to green, and provided in devices we set the device correctly, this will always be right whether we reverse it or turn it the other way because this clear tube that we hooked up over here is always hooked up and there's a little tiny pressure pickup point right there that this green tube goes from here through the fan to this point so it's always referencing the pressure properly and determining what the pressure is between the front of the fan and inside the fan so this is the flow signal or the fan pressure signal that's coming out and this one's always correct as long as the device is correctly entered into the gauge